back to Roan Hollow, episode 4. It's been a little while since I got the footers in place. Today we're going to see the building of the shed, or most of it. Today, starting on the shed, stopped at Lowe's in Mount Airy, picked up a whole bunch of floor joists, 2x8s by 12s. Um, framing it up, I wanted to keep it off the pads, just to keep it up off the ground, so I'm using blocks of good hardwood here. That I've cut. This is my inner frame. I'll have the double uh, skirt around it, so I got it cut in three inches on the edges and leveled it up. Oops, got these cut, ready to put in this last piece right here, and that one over there. I'll keep going. Post as I progress or progress. Okay, so update. I got all the joist hangers in. Got all the joists in. I uh, put the blocking across the middle there, put in the center support, 2x8 running across there. So this is what it's looking like right now. The door will be in, on the side at this corner right here. And I'll either have to build steps up here or a ground level ramp that just follows right along the level there and you turn right into the door. We'll see. Haven't decided which one yet. Getting near nightfall. The sun's already behind the mountains over there. Mom and Dad and I just finished up. Let me back up a little bit here. We got the floor done. Got the walls up. Those two great big beams or the roof beam will be up there almost 15 foot high there'll be a loft up in there might be a little high i might cut those off a little more <laughs> we'll see would have been easier when they're on the ground though uh, but that's what we're doing got done today it's kind of hard to see the fire walls got three large openings in it those will be windows i'll walk over there we'll see excuse the bouncing camera Got fairly warm today, so it kind of got messy out here. See, I'll frame those windows up tomorrow. I don't have the windows for a while. They're just going to get plywood over them, or OSB. But there we go. And here's the building as it is framed up with the posts up. And this next shot is just a view out the camper window. Got up this morning. It was in the about 19 degrees. Nice and chilly out. Stayed 50 in the camper. Here's the building with the T111 siding on it. Going all the way around. I haven't cut the windows or door out yet. Uh, that opening is where we're going in and out. There's going to be a window there that's on the uphill side. And here's me up uh, putting up the ridge beam two two by eights 16 foot long sandwiched on four by fours there's still me working on their bridge cap clamping them in place before i get the screws and bolts into them and here i got half of the roof joists or the rafters up uh, later that night i was out and at about nine o'clock at night cutting all the remaining rafters for the shed so the next morning as you see in this picture we have them all up now I didn't have to cut them in the morning getting the, some of the plywood up setting up on the ridge it's a good bit of work getting that pulled up there uh, there's me on the ladder it's about a 12 12 pitch right here on this side so it was not definitely not something to stand on and then I got all the plywood on the this one side got the edges trimmed off so it's squared up and lastly here it is all tarped up ready for the rain and snow we're supposed to get the remainder of the weekend and about President's Day weekend well, I'll be back up to hopefully finish up the build uh, thanks again for watching this was Roan Hollow episode 4 and check in in a couple weeks for the next one